Hello and welcome to IndiaInfoline.com. The BSE Sensex opened at 25,798, touched an intraday low of 25,670 and finally ended with a gain of 41 points at 25,864. The NSE Nifty opened negative at 7,838, hitting a low of 7,804 before signing off with a gain of 23 points or 0.29% at 7,869. The Indian currency was quoted at 66.11 per US dollar, down 16 paise from the previous trading session. After slipping sharply in the August series, the Indian equity markets further extended their declining trend as the September series too closed in the negative terrain. The BSE Sensex and NSE Nifty closed lower by 1.4% in the September series. Coming back to today's session, the Indian equity markets closed with modest gains amid a choppy futures and option expiry session. After opening with a negative gap down, indices gained ground as the day progressed. However, Nifty was unable to surpass the resistance of 7,900 mark, which was the volume weighted average price for the last six days. The capital goods, metals and oil and gas stocks were among the top losers. On the other hand, Major gainers were the IT, healthcare, and FMCG stocks. Even the mid cap and small cap stocks ended with modest gains. Commenting on the RBI meet, which is scheduled next week, Amar Ambani, head of research IIFL, said Although consensus is a cut in repo rate by at least 25 basis points, markets focus will be more accentuated on the stance which Mr. Raja endorses. The language of the central bank will determine the broader trajectory. We expect a rate cut accompanied with a cautious outlook considering that adverse impact of poor monsoon has not yet been quantified. In addition, RBI will also have an eye on Fed, wherein the dust has not yet settled down on the possibility of hike in US interest rates. This was it from the Post Market Review. For more updates, download the IIFL mobile app or log on to www.indiainfoline.com. Thank you.